It is 5.12, beautiful Wednesday morning, and it's time to try it. And more specifically, time to kill my darlings. So, ding, 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 it has come to my attention that I am focusing on too many things. That's not relevant. So, the things that I have on my table, number one is business acquisition. That's the first thing. Business coaching. I'm going to say add life. It's number two. And then from there, we have agency business. Okay. And this is where distraction starts. Wherein we have uncompromised, which is supposedly what I'm supposed to be doing now, in regards to my focus block. If I quickly go and click onto my calendar. I have asset crafting and prospecting, which is in regards to, I'm not sure if this thing's still recording, but anyways, in regards to the vision and mission statement that I'd be crafting. And to be honest, it needs to change. Asset crafting and prospecting shouldn't be for something like this, because it just takes away from the top few things that in itself needs to be distilled into one. Okay. Let's take a look at my notion. You won't be able to see it because this is camera only. Now in my notion, I have sales. In sales, I have way too many things going on. In terms of my office. I've got uncompromised health, which is this. I've got ping on food, which is another one. My mom's thing. Ping on food. So two. Cool. I have socials with William, uncompromising with William, which is basically this is online coaching. Movies with William, Christianity with William, all the time merch sale with Heban Media. Okay, sale with Heban Media with the agency business, all the time merch, something completely different. I haven't really been spending time there. Christianity with William. I haven't really been spending time there. So I have been spreading my attention through these three different facets slash areas, if you want to call them. Immediately, this needs to go. Uncompromised and clean food. As much as it's good and it generates something, it is a big distraction from the top stuff. And how I serve myself as well as the other people in my life when it comes to my working hours. This does bring money on the table, but very little money in comparison to this on top because here there's logistics and there is X, Y, and Z that comes along with it. And with Uncompromised, there's also a lot of costs affixed to it, 
which wouldn't be the most or highest leverage business to enact. And that's where we get onto the top, the top three, business acquisition, business life coaching, and agency business. Wherein yesterday, I officially made it very clear on my LinkedIn, as well as in the branding itself, that Heaven Heaven Media is changing to just Heaven. Now, what is Heaven? Because it used to be an advertising firm. Now, that's what I'll say is it's a business acquisition firm. What is it? It's a consulting acquisition. What am I as a individual within this firm? Is something I was thinking about yesterday. Soldiers identify as Alchemists, we made nothing, or rather something out of nothing. And I was thinking entrepreneurial alchemists. Now, what's our mission? It used to be reforming education. Since we only served coaching businesses and online education, that no longer is the case because we serve everyone in and around us. So mission, I need to think now, should be both inward facing and outward facing so that every player, whether it be a client or an employee, feels as if they're contributing, uh, contributing towards the mission. So 
And the item invokes a motion. It doesn't focus on the problem for which right now one of the main problems that pop into mind is mediocrity. What is the opposite of mediocrity? I'm going to quickly give that a Google search. Antonym. Excellent. Okay. All right. Two. Lead. Excellence. I will change that. to impact and excellence. What's our vision? that can be achieved. For me, I'm going to say serving eight crazy ones. Meaning big clients. And that inherently should create a class system because we're going to be classes <laughs> in the best way possible. three different tiers. Normal, you got normal, we got Usual. And we have crazy.
this one I still need to think of a better tier when we serve people they basically come in at whatever stage they're really at so if they're normal and by normal I will have parameters for what normal means or unusual or crazy they will fit or slot into X, Y, and Z. Here's the definition of crazy. So reverse engineer as to what an unusual or normal person would be is for me want I'm going to turn this to red want over Need <laughs> values over. Impact. So, think at the normal stage. Someone would just be normal, unusual, crazy. What is the opposite of visionary? Use that.
Und so be it. Now, what I do to update my assets would essentially mean changing on the wall my my website. We serve the crazy ones scaling business and impact. Efficiency, agility, and sustainability. All right. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Philosophy. What about philosophy? Philosophy, about resourcefulness. So I can combine it. Resourceful self mastery. Okay. Services.
This is where I need to consult arc eight level. I don't want the services page. I want it to be within. So services we have. It's basically full stack. Though immediately There would be coaching. Then it would be application. Amplification and expansion is very similar. So. Diversification. Work and verification. Agency work. Position.
Okay. So these are my services. This is the entire. This is the entire thing. And I need to go ahead and update it on my website. Hope you guys enjoyed. This has been Mission and Vision Crafting. There we go. In my own sense. Didn't really explain it, so. Top part was more laying out where I'm spending my time currently. Then this part was how I changed what I used to do to something I do now, just by simply changing the name and removing the word media, because you don't need to go grab a whole new idea. The name of your business can stick, it's fine. Soldiers, meaning the people within, as well as the people outside, I would identify as an entrepreneurial alchemist, The mission is to impact with excellence. The vision is to serve eight crazy ones. Mission is something you can never achieve. For example, honesty. You have the opportunity to be honest every single day. You have the opportunity to impact with excellence or with mediocrity. Up to you. Vision is something you can achieve. Serving eight crazy ones. There's a definitive number, specific, and if you want to use time, you can add a deadline. And we have a class system to what we classify a crazy one to be. Normal, unusual, crazy. The normal is someone who acts on their wants and not their needs. They understand that they don't need anything, they just want it. Unusual is that they would take over their impact, their value system. So if something is in jeopardy of their values in order to grow, they're not going to grow. Visionary versus proven, overproven, meaning you are the first in the space. You are pioneering. You are essentially laying new rules, foundations, and not building a replicate business of something else that works. And there being no shame in being in any of the three categories because they're extremely high to begin with. The philosophy is to be resourceful and to master the self. And if you boil it down into one word or rather one sentence, it would be resourceful self-mastery because I feel as if business is just an amplification of yourself. And if there are personal problems, there is going to be business problems or it's going to transfer into your business, which will affect your day-to-day -day operations and impact. Services, revision, which is to do change up in your operations, your anything in your business. Amplification, which is agency work, which is essentially expanding them. And then diversification, acquisition work, where they essentially go into different territories because they have more money. Outside money. Cool. So that's basically it. How I target people now is I open up with the sentence of acquisition work, which I will lay the foundation that I would like all dealings to be concluded within eight months. And within those eight months, they have the opportunity to do agency work application as well as revision coaching work with me so they can prove that they're they're worth it to go ahead and have me acquire a percentage if not the whole entirety of their business obviously with crazy ones you're not going to be able to acquire the entire business 
unusual ones and normal ones, maybe. Maybe. So, yeah. That's the full process in my mind. Have you guys enjoyed? Well, go ahead, start your own thing. <laughs> Here's the framework, that's how I think. And this whole process and thinking is, is not unique or original to my own creation. It's a culmination of getting different pieces of information from everywhere. So that's it. Have a great day.